guys welcome to today's video thank you so much for stopping by in case you're new here my name is Kristen. i'm a mother of three and a wife if you are returning thank you so much for always stopping by so in today's video we are going to do lots of organizing decluttering and cleaning guys so these clothes were washed yesterday by my uh hubby yeah I, I have not been feeling well for the past one week so i didn't have the energy to do the cleaning so today i just want to uh, make sure that they are folded and organized yeah so i am just going to fold them then i will be organizing the closet but first of all we have to declutter lots of books and other clothes uh before we organize these ones so please stay tuned uh make sure that you like the video comment share if you can and uh kindly do not skip the ads guys so let's get into the video and i hope that you enjoy the video Ooh, ah. talking to me with your eyes i get a hint of the perfume that i like wear it like a disguise Come around with the perfect alibi A midnight pouring my heart out like it's water Tick tock, you know this night ain't getting younger Feels like chasing a star up and down in the sky so i was as i was folding i was just trying to have something little uh, to eat so i had made some oats that's why you can see a bowl a bowl there yeah so i was uh, snacking on some oats because i was feeling uh, i wasn't feeling the energy so i wanted to energize myself uh, before doing the cleaning i knew that there's a lot waiting for me guys and i really did a lot a lot of work in my bedroom guys yeah so i had to eat i really don't love oats but uh today i decided that is what i'm going to eat because i normally don't like uh breakfast in the morning and it was around um it was around 10 yeah so i just had to eat on something my breakfast normally starts from 1 or 2 p.m yeah on a normal day Oh, it's 
the top of different day. I can't get enough of sweet, sweet love and life with just a couple beats, please. I'm glued to you, honey, like a leaf. Before we start with the bedroom, let me just show you how it looks like. Yeah, you can see I've carried uh, my clothes to the bed and the other clothes I've taken to the kids' bedroom. Uh, that is the closet. So disorganized, guys. Yeah, it's been some few days that I've not cleaned this room because where well, I was not well. And uh, Habi is trying to help. So he's trying to declutter on some books. We have lots and lots and lots of books, documents that we need to declutter. So I asked him to help because some of them are his, belong to him. And so he needed to be around so he can know what he wants to throw away and what he still wants to keep. But let me tell you, we ended up uh, storing most of our books, textbooks, uh, like uh, those textbooks that we used in campus and uh, yeah so most of them i had personally i had so many human resource textbooks and i had to keep them because you know get buying such textbooks are very expensive and uh, i can't just dispose our uh, textbooks uh like that such textbooks so i had to keep a lot of textbooks that i used to do to i used in campus yes i'm a uh, I'm a trained HR. Yeah, that is my profession, guys. So I also had to keep some of the notebooks in case I might, uh, some of my notes in case I may need them in future. Yeah, so I started up with my closet part and I, I was also decluttering some of my clothes because I didn't feel like they were giving me a vibe anymore. Yeah, they are clothes that I've worn for so long. So I was trying to just uh, declutter them so I can have, uh, I can restock on some whenever I get some money. It's been a while since I bought myself clothes. Long time, uh, some time back I used to buy at least a dress, uh, two dresses monthly. But nowadays I've disciplined myself and I don't just buy uh, dresses like that aimlessly here. Yeah. So I'm going to organize my part of the closet, then uh, organize my hubbies. I'm also uh, decluttering hubby's side so that we can uh, do the do her his closet re, revamp. Yeah, we, we will be doing his closet revamp very soon. Yeah, and I'll also declutter my throw covers and all that, guys. So continue watching the video and kindly... Please stay, stick here till the end. I'm walking around with a smile. You got me feeling like a view after night. Yeah. Tearing it up with the star, 
got me living a brand new kind of life. At midnight, pouring my heart out like it's water. Tick tock, you know this night ain't getting younger. Feels like chasing a star up and down in the sky. So I'm almost through with the closet part and this is how the mess is still here guys. Yeah, so hubby is still organizing uh, these things. Yeah, so I will leave the books for him. He's also trying to declutter mine and uh, just showing me what if I to confirm uh, if he needs to dispose or not. So he, that is his work. And uh, so I will go on with uh, my... Um, my other side where I keep uh, extra curtain, throw covers, throw blankets, uh, duvet covers. Yeah, this is the part I use for that. And um, I will be needing an ottoman. Yeah, that is a storage, some storage. It's called an ottoman and uh, that I want to be using for my extra curtain, duvet covers, throw blankets. Yeah, that one will specifically be for that but uh, i won't be getting it anytime soon maybe next year because the this year is almost ending so that is a plan for next year because i really need some more storage in this bedroom i don't want this space to look this uh this full yeah i don't want this open space to look this full so i will need that ottoman so that i can keep some of this item and just close them there Right now I want to declutter on some of the throw covers. I still have my Christmas throw covers. They are here. I used them last year. Yeah, so I will also use them this year. I think so. I need to decorate for the kids, guys. Yeah, so I think I will be using the same. So the blue covers that I'm putting aside, I'm decluttering them. Yeah, these ones. I'm decluttering these ones. They are still perfect condition, very new, just that they are not my vibe anymore. Yeah, I didn't use them for long. I also I was also thinking of decluttering the ones I'm holding, guys. Yeah, because I've not used them for so long. Why keep something that you haven't used for so long? Yeah, so I think I will be giving them out. Yeah, so uh, some other items I was uh, still thinking, should I declutter or not? You know that that feeling, guys. You hold on something, you hold on to something, and you are not sure. So the other gold ones, I decluttered all, all, all of them, guys. Yeah, so I didn't remain with so many throw covers. 
but uh, I need some that I have already identified that I'll be getting. So after doing my closet side, plus the shoes, everything, I went into cleaning and I started from my windows. So the windows, I'm just using soapy water. Today, I won't be using uh, the window cleaner. I have it in the house, but I just felt like I wanted to wipe uh, using soapy water. Uh, next, I will use my window cleaner to clean my bedside mirrors and uh, these cabinets. I'll just wipe the cabinets uh, just to wipe away dust. As I had told you before in my previous videos, this building is being constructed and uh, there's a lot of dust, guys, coming through uh, these uh, windows. So the rooms get dusty, especially when you make a mistake of opening the windows when they are carrying sand from the from ground floor to to the rooftop for construction guys yeah so at times there is some dust uh getting inside the house so you need to make sure that you do the wiping every every day or every now and then to just uh, remove uh the dust so i will also remove my beddings uh these beddings are not dirty i'm just folding them to make sure that they don't pile in my laundry basket yeah so when you fold dirty clothes they don't get to pile in your laundry basket they look they look organized actually so i will also vacuum my mattress uh or I'll, I'll also vacuum my mattress and turn it and vacuum the other side too so this mattress is still nice but I just want to get another mattress, uh, but uh, yeah, I want to get another mattress. I'm still thinking of which mattress I should be getting, which is not too expensive for me. Yeah, the one that I can afford, but also a good mattress. Yeah, so I will also go and uh, go ahead and wipe my bed. And I'm using the Astonish, uh, Astonish Cleaner, the Upholstery and Carpet Cleaner. Yeah, this is the one I normally use. So if you want such a bed and especially a bright color, guys, be ready to be cleaning it, guys. Especially when you live in a dusty area, be ready to be cleaning it once in a while so that you can just maintain uh, its color and uh, its neatness, guys.
Lastly, I'm going to vacuum the carpet and I need to remove it so I can give this room a good clean. Yes, I'm cleaning the whole floor guys. So I'm just vacuuming it and I will remove it, hang it on the balcony side so that it can get some sun before returning it. Next we are going to mop the floors and I'm just using uh, normal water that I've put in my homemade soap and some jig. I also made uh, the jig by myself. If you don't know where to get these uh, chemicals, you can get them at OTC just uh, behind Quick Mart. There, there is at the Quick Mart entrance at uh, OTC, there is a panya root there. Uh, when you just stand there and ask even a soldier where you can buy chemicals for making soap, they'll be able to direct you to that building. It's not even 50 meters from the entrance, guys. Yeah, it's just next to that end. So you can get your chemicals from there. So I've, I'm pushing the bed because I want to mop uh, to ensure that the, the whole floor is clean, guys. I don't want to be using a mop to stretch under the bed. I just want to clean the whole floor with a duster. And uh, for the box, uh, you, you know, we normally keep those boxes be under the beds or uh, in the wardrobe closet so that we can use it to carry our televisions whenever we are shifting, guys. That's why it's there. I know most of you understand. So right now we are done with the bedroom and uh, we now want to clean the master bathroom. So I felt that I can't clean the bedroom that way and leave the master bathroom. So I'm just soaking the whole seat uh, bowl with uh, my homemade soap and I'm also soaking my sink with my homemade soap with uh, some Vim scoring powder. Yeah, So I will go ahead and clean this uh, doormat. Uh, before I proceed to cleaning the washroom. One thing that I loved about uh, this day is the steel wool that I was using. Actually, I took two steel wools, yeah, two rolls of the small steel wools, Soconi steel wools, wrapped them together, opened them, 
uh, fix them together and open them wildly guys you can try that hack when you open them so widely it becomes so easy to clean so i was just uh, passing the steel wool onto the on the two onto the tiles of uh, the wall and uh, it was covering such a big space and uh, the cleaning it made the cleaning so 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 easy and i think i'm going to be doing this so other for other times i don't normally open the steel wools wide but when you take two pieces and uh, join them and open them so widely guys it works marvelous <laughs> So after cleaning the washroom, it was now time to make the bed. Yeah, the floor tiles were now well dried. So I decided to make the bed and I was using my normal blanket. So I want I want to buy a mattress protector, but uh, I don't know why I'm de delaying. I, I, I'm trying to think that uh, the best time to buy it is when I'll be buying my new mattress. Yeah, of course, I have to get one when I get a new mattress, but for now we can still use this one. Yeah, but when I get a new mattress, I will obviously get a mattress protector, guys. Yeah. 
So after making the bed, Habi helped me return the carpet. Of course, by now he had already picked the twins from school. So when I was cleaning the washroom, he had rushed to school to pick the twins. Yeah, so he came and helped me return the carpet, guys. And that was all I had to do this day. And I really loved the outcome. My whole room was clean, organized, and fresh. I just loved this part. And I felt like I should clean the whole house. But I was so exhausted. And guys, this day, I didn't sleep because my cold uh, came back. Yeah, it came back in a full force. But in a full force, and uh, yeah, I got I got even more sick. But at least I had done something in this room. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Till this far, I really appreciate you being here. I really uh, love your presence. I really love your reading your comments. I love I love uh, seeing your likes, guys. And I, I am happy that I have a family, another family on this channel, guys, that uh, wait for my content. I really appreciate so much. And if you are new here, you haven't subscribed, kindly, kindly subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I post a new video. And kindly do not forget to like, share, comment, and watch the ads. See you in my next one. Goodbye, guys.